Namaste and welcome back to my channel. This is a yoga sequence that you can practice just before bedtime to allow a complete release of tension physically and mentally and to get you ready for a good night's sleep. So we'll start off in a comfortable seat. You can either sit on a chair, on your bed or on the floor. Place a cushion or a pillow or a block underneath the sitting bones if that helps you get into a more comfortable seated position. And we're just going to gently close our eyes. And with your eyes closed, allow yourself to rest comfortably into your breath. Just starting to notice your breath as you inhale and exhale through the nose. And be patient with yourself as your breath slowly comes back to its natural rhythm. Know that you have the power and the ability to bring back that sense of softness, of emptiness in times of any challenge. And your breath is your greatest tool. So just allow yourself to connect to your own body through your breath. And every time you take a moment to connect with yourself through your breath, you're able to turn on, to flip on this internal healing process, just like a switch. And allow the juices of life to just flow through your body. So letting go of any to-do list, of any responsibilities, allow yourself to stay present in this moment enjoying this as a gift to yourself because you deserve it take a couple of more breaths here feeling your breath as you inhale and as you exhale noticing how the body feels finding finding that stillness and that softness throughout the body and then whenever you're ready, slowly blink your eyes to open. We're going to move on to child's pose, Balasan. So for that, bring your knees together. You can place a little blanket or a pillow underneath the knees or in between your shins and your thighs if you need to. And we're going to allow our arms to come by the sides of the body, palms facing up. And then slowly with the breath out, allow your chest to melt down towards your thighs, your forehead to melt down towards the floor. If your forehead does not reach the floor, feel free to grab a cushion or just a block or even a pillow and place it underneath the forehead just to allow your head to feel comfortable, your neck to feel comfortable. And here, use your breath to take a quick scan of your body. Is there any area of the body that is asking for a little more attention? Send your breath there. Allow your breath to soften the area. Notice if you can soften your shoulders a little more, allowing any tension from that area to melt away. Allow your arms to feel heavy towards the floor and feel that nice stretch in your lower back, in your mid back. And we're going to take two cleansing breaths here together. So inhale through the nose and exhale through the mouth. Sighing everything out. And feel how that helps you release that tension as if it was just melting out of your body into the ground. Let's do that one more time. Inhale through the nose. Open the mouth. Exhale, sigh it out. Take one or two more breaths here. Completely letting go of any gripping that you think you might have. 
And then when you're ready, bring your palms to the floor to help yourself up. Place the cushion away or underneath your sitting bones if you need a little bit of a lift. And we're going to stretch the legs forward. Okay. So either the legs are straight or you can come into a diamond shape, bending the knees, allowing the feet to come together. You can place blocks underneath the knees to help uh, support them or cushions, whatever you need to make yourself feel comfortable. And from here, we're going to just inhale and then exhale to lean forward and fold forward. Just letting this fold be a little passive. Maybe the palms can face up so that you don't have any urge to pull or push to get deeper into this forward fold. So just allowing this forward fold to feel nice and passive and relaxing. Again, if you'd like to keep a couple of cushions and a block or a couple of blocks to just give some support underneath your head, feel free to do so. If your legs are straight, you can just keep a little bent in the knees, a soft bend is always welcome. And fold forward. Allow that release of tension through the back of the neck, through the shoulders, through the upper back, right down to the low back. And see if you can let go of any judgment or ego that you feel you might be still holding on to. Treat this as a gift for yourself to stay present and know that you can't breathe a past breath in this moment, neither can you breathe a future breath right now. So all you have is the present breath. So make sure you're tuning into the power of every breath as you're here right now, right here. Let's take two or three more breaths here. And this is a wonderful stretch, not only for all the muscles that line your spine, but also for the backs of your legs. And then whenever you're ready, slowly unfold from this posture. And we're going to do a few shoulder rolls because a lot of times uh, emotional stress or tension or mental stress tends to manifest uh, itself in the form of aches or pains in the shoulders and the neck. So we're just going to do a couple of shoulder rolls. So sitting up nice and upright, bring your shoulders inward. So loop them in and forward. Bring them all the way up to the ears. Back as if you wanted to squeeze the shoulder blades together and then drop them down towards the floor. Circle them around one more time. Forward, up and back, staying with your breath. Moving with your breath. Really going at your own pace. Maybe sending your breath into the shoulders as you do so. Let's take three in the opposite direction now. Starting from the back all the way up and forward. Loop them in and down. Noticing if there's any tension still in the facial muscles, allow them to melt. Allow that tension to melt away. Allow those muscles to soften. And let's take one last round here. And now we're going to interlace our fingers behind the head. And without pushing or pulling, we're just going to place the palms just where our neck meets the head. And then allow the weight of the elbows to drop down towards the floor. So that will just give your neck a nice little gentle stretch without pulling or pushing too hard. Just allowing that weight of the elbows to drop down. Still keeping your back straight. You're just getting that stretch in the neck. And I invite you 
to stay present with your breath and send your next breath into the neck, wherever you're feeling that sensation. Staying present with what your body's feeling, how your body is slowly releasing that tension and acknowledging the power of your mind to guide your body into this relaxation. And then slowly and gently release, release the fingers and come back to your seat. I'm going to turn this way. So we're going to give our shoulders a nice little stretch again. Reach the right hand up and bend the elbow so that you can touch the center of your back. With your left hand, grab onto the right elbow, lift up as you inhale, and then as you exhale, we're just going to allow again the weight of our left elbow to drop down towards the side. And feel that nice stretch in the right side of the body, still keeping the chest nice and open. And then coming back to center and switching sides. So the left hand reaches for the center of the back. Right hand grabs onto the elbow, lifts up, and then leans over towards the right side. This really feels good, not only in the shoulder, but also the sides of the waist, sides of the chest, as if it was creating space between each rib. And then slowly release. I hope you feel good. I feel amazing after just these couple of stretches. And now we're just going to make our way into Shavasana. So take your time and allow yourself to come down into Shavasana. So grab onto the backs of your thighs and slowly roll down. So make sure you have about two feet in between both your legs. Let the toes drop down towards the side and allow your arms to be about one foot away from your body, palms facing up. And just breathe in and out through the nose. Allow your entire body to let go of any gripping. Again, acknowledge the power of your mind to guide your body into this relaxation and ask your body for a release of tension and notice how the body responds to this and we're going to start off by silently repeating to ourselves my feet are relaxed my ankles are relaxed My shins are relaxed. My knees are relaxed. My thighs are relaxed. My hips are relaxed. My lower back is relaxed. My belly is relaxed. My upper back is relaxed. My chest is relaxed. My shoulders are relaxed. My arms are relaxed. My wrists are relaxed. My hands are relaxed. The back of my neck is relaxed. My throat is relaxed. The back of my head is relaxed. My forehead and my eyebrows are relaxed. My eyes are relaxed. My cheeks and my jaw is relaxed. My lips are relaxed. My chin 
is relaxed. My entire body is relaxed. My mind is relaxed. Feel free to stay in Shavasana or this relaxation posture as long as you wish to. Thank you for joining me in this practice. Namaste.